Convenience stores in Ontario have long been the place for a lottery ticket or an impromptu snack. Now add booze to that list. A potential lifeline for retailers who say their sales have been flat since the pandemic. In my view, my sale will be increased more than 30 to 40 percent. Because when they will come for the buying a beer, they will buy lottery, they will buy gum, candy. This store in downtown Toronto is one of thousands across the province now allowed to sell beer, wine and cocktails from 7 a.m. till 11 p.m., much longer hours than anywhere else in the province. Choice and convenience now at a store near you. The move comes years after a campaign promised by Premier Doug Ford to modernize alcohol sales. But the move is going to cost the province $225 million to get out of a contract with the beer store to pave way for convenience stores. They're well equipped. They've dealt with uh, everything from tobacco to lottery tickets, now beer and wine, and they're going to be very responsible. Quebec, Alberta and Newfoundland and Labrador already allow alcohol sales in convenience stores. On day one in Ontario, the move appears popular. There shouldn't be a reason why it should all be congregated in one place necessarily or monopolized for that matter. I think as long as it's done responsibly um, and it's regulated um, and it's not the wild, wild west. Still, there are concerns among some groups, including educators. And to have the convenience stores so close to the schools, um, I'm hoping that those who are working in the convenience stores will do their due diligence and make sure they're selling to people who should be allowed to buy alcohol according to their age. But store owners will face stiff fines and lose their license if they're caught breaking the rules. The prices in Ontario won't be regulated, which means shoppers may need to pay more for that convenience. Jamie Strachan, CBC News, Toronto.